Once upon a time, when there were no water closets in our homes, the bushes had to endure the stench of human waste. When attending nature's call involved the trek outdoors, one had to be accompanied by loved ones to ward off attacks, especially at night. As the saying goes, necessity is the mother of invention. A small pot usually designed to fit under a bed or in a discreet place came into existence and the chamber pot was born. The basic design of a chamber pot involves a deep pot enough to hold urine without splashing and a secure lid. It usually has handles so that it can easily be carried. People who need to go to the bathroom at night would use it and empty it in the morning. Due to its use, the chamber pot is commonly placed under a bed because it is a convenient and ready location. In homes which had a household staff, a house help would empty the chamber pot as part of her morning chores. In recent times, chamber pots are not as widely used as they once were, having largely been replaced by indoor toilets, but their importance cannot be overruled. One may ask, why would a household or an individual feel the need to own a chamber pot when water closets are now closer to us than ever? It is something our mothers always use, especially during pregnancy and at night when you can't walk in the dark to attend to nature's call. If someone is sick and cannot use the toilet, such a person can use the chamber pot and cover it to be disposed, making it very neat. They come in different shapes, colors and sizes to fit even the heaviest individual. It is made from different materials including plastic, metal and sometimes bronze for elite households. While more impoverished households have very plain chamber pots brightened only by its colors, extant examples of lavishly decorated chamber pots can be found in some museums. Chamber pots continue in use today in rural areas lacking indoor plumbing and have been redesigned as the bedpan for the elderly or very ill who use it for spitting and vomiting. Interestingly, it is not only in rural areas that chamber pots abound. Today, even the most sophisticated households have chamber pots for varying uses and traders continue to make sales especially from pregnant women. People really buy the chamber pots because after birth you may not be able to get up onto the normal toilet seat to urinate or vomit. I don't know when you now hospital I edge crap. Okay, say beer, funny say beer, what will a real? Even though different categories of people use the chamber pot, children are usually the greatest beneficiaries. This is because in many cases, it is difficult for them to get up onto the normal toilet seat. Additionally, the larger opening of the regular toilet is too large for a child to sit over comfortably and not fall in without some type of aid.
fascinatingly. Children nowadays are not too keen on the chamber pots because of the use of pampas. They will rather make do with their pampas than be bothered by the chamber pots. <laughs> Children are no more interested in the chamber court. To get them to use it, you have to make it attractive and an enjoyable experience for them. One grandchild of mine is 12 years but prefers to, to urinate on herself instead of getting up at night because she claims her sister is allowed to wear pumpers and urinate in it at night. When you are twelve years, sweets. <laughs> Now, now to the business and then court is a first new view. Uh because of that, because of die panel banning, you know, in Colano, age study you should die panel from bed. Sam, the big, you know, the beer, if if you are the cooking a diaper, Sam, you like the big, for example, you say, maybe I or two years, but during the time, no, of a soap, on country. Yeah, yeah. What I said, small uh, toilet seat for babies. Even those who use it have to be lured by these exciting looking chamber pots in the shapes of different objects attractive to children. Your guess is as good as mine. The fancier the chamber pots, the more expensive it is. These ones that come in fascinating shapes specifically made for children cost between 15 to 50 cities. The child is able to rest his back and may be too reluctant to get up. Children arguably benefit from the chamber pot more than others because for them, the feet of their mothers can also be converted into human chamber pots when emergency demands it. <laughs> In the olden days, we used our feet for chamber court when necessary, but now no mother has time. The mother neatly cleans up after the child, even when she finds herself in a public place with her child. This human invented chamber pot is absolutely free. However, cheaper human made chamber pots range from two Ghana cities to five Ghana cities. But don't be deceived, a very heavy person can sit on a chamber pot such as this so far as there is comfort and it will not break. This metallic chamber pot which goes for 10 Ghana CDs has been known to last for more than 20 years, if well kept. Today, one does not have to carry a chamber pot in the open outside the house. This design is deceptive, making people doubt it is a chamber pot when indeed it is used exactly for the same purpose. <laughs> In the olden days, it was only metallic, but these plastic ones made for elderly women is also very strong and unbreakable no matter how big you are. With the cover, no one can easily identify its contents. Name Pacho, hey, who you see crabba? Me you see crabba. Eh, crabba na ya set the four crabba no. Oh, na zetia then now you see. Na zetia we bucket. Kaya didi ti se kava also. Nti ujun so wea na wa kataso. Hey. Eh, zetia ye trim. Is it we senpai? Senpai, sumne he. 
and you put away a old determiner, or be one at the proper home. And I shall be before Gary Binagum. So, Nay Johnson. What do you so fear? Now, Pesel, who could to go? Who can't have come a camas and be an inside Johnson a woman with Covano? Just a Johnson will mukra, and I said, We are not a person, I ain't neat, and he will be here. The other ones now, we got Covano, a year old pain. Johnson will find a baby, and I will be a shell now, or share. The contents of the chamber pot can be described as unsightly, but its shape in recent times make it attractive for an unusual use.